Uh, there's no other organic sweet potatoes in Arkansas, and there's only about six or seven producers of organic sweet potatoes in the United States. When these boxes are full, he'll pull up here and unload. Every box is tagged before it leaves that digger. There's one guy on there that's gonna mark each box, what's in it, jumbos, ones, twos, or canners. Right now, we are moving canners to Costco. So when those boxes are loaded on that truck, they have a tag. That tag is a destination for them to be in that warehouse. Whether they go to the left side of the warehouse for storage where number ones go, the right side for jumbos, the center for number twos, and the canners go right to the wash line where I've got guys washing those loads out and we've got two trucks from Pennsylvania sitting there now for loads and those will leave immediately for basically just for potato chips. We do a lot of business with Walmarts and Sam's Clubs so you'll see you'll see Arkansas sweet potatoes and, and more and more of the companies are trying to do local. Uh, it's a big push in the nation to be local, cut down the environmental footprint of that company so we're seeing more and more companies come to us that are Arkansas based. We've got a big processing plant that was built in Wynn, belongs to Ridgeview Farms. They are contracting more and more acres, and I think it's uh, becoming more of a mainstream crop for Arkansas.